Manchester City v Birmingham at Manchester Sports City. The Midlanders coming in two points behind leaders Chelsea. Defeat in their previous match against Liverpool was a hammer blow, but there didn't seem any trace of a hangover, not early on at least. Karen Carney's cross had keeper Karen Barsley grasping at fresh air. Jessica Carter didn't miss by much. And 15 minutes in, Birmingham were in front. Joe Potter picking out Carney with admirable precision. Bardsley got her fingertips to the lob, but couldn't keep it out. The home side's best effort came from a set play. The ball nodded down by Steph Horton, goalwards by Jill Scott, and away by Chelsea Weston on the line. Too often, though, City were nearly the architects of their own demise. Isabel Christensen rather too casual in possession, and Melissa Lawley given a sight of goal as a result. It may have been going wide, but Barnsley couldn't take the chance. Quite how it was still only 1-0 was anyone's guess. Weston, always ready, willing and more than able to get forward. Her ball to Kirsty Linnett deserved better. Into the second half, and as so often happens, a team get punished for their profligacy, because just past the hour mark, City equalised. A sumptuous volley from Scott that simply flew past Becky Spencer. That effectively meant Birmingham had to score again to have any chance of becoming champions. And four minutes from time, they got the goal they craved, although Bardsley certainly won't want to see it again. Her miscued clearance fell straight to Linnett, who played in Carney. And now the title will go down to the white. <laughs>